Hey everyone, welcome to the Chris Carver channel. Okay, I made the ultimate decision uh, about two days ago about uh, removing the father from the babies here. Uh, in one of the previous videos, I showed that I took the mother out because she had eaten one of the babies and then the father started beating her up. So she was staying in this corner over here and she was not allowed to leave that corner. She was getting punished. And every time she left that corner, he beat her up. So he was still defending all these babies in here. And, you know, a couple days ago, I thought, you know what? I'm just going to let these guys grow up by themselves. So I took the father out and I put him in the 125 behind me, which I'll do an updated video on that because it does have uh, my Oscar and um, let's see here, the flower horn and the red Texas and the regular Texas and a few other fish in there. And I haven't done a video on that one for a while. So that one's the next video to do. But today... <clears throat> I'm just showing you what these guys look like. And one guy asked me, or one gal, I don't know who exactly who it was, uh, asked me about the black convicts and how they didn't see black convicts in the last video because the white convicts obviously stick out. And you can see there's so many of them. They're so cute. And down here is where the black convicts like to sit. Like, as you can see, there's some here. There's a whole bunch like right there. They, they really blend into these rocks, so it's kind of hard to see them. But they are in there. I don't think there's quite as many black convicts as there are white convicts. Like, like that's the difference. There's a black one, that's a white one. But these guys, oh, they're so happy to see me too. You guys wanna eat something? I'm gonna show you how I feed them. They're like really cool. But yeah, that's, that's just what comes up here. There's still some in the back underneath the rocks back here and they kind of just like linger down here until I feed them so I'll go ahead and feed them just to show you what it looks like see if I can do this one-handed let you guys watch these while I get this okay, I'm just feeding them basic flake food this stuff right here and with these guys I normally get a good pinch about like this because there's so many and I try to crush it up in my fingertips before I throw it in there so it's really easy for them to uh, eat so I'm going to go ahead and do this and I didn't get it crushed up as well as I normally do and I'll just spread it out like that and they will make this stuff disappear and they're so cute as they try to eat these things these big old flakes like pop them in the side of the head like what is that? Like him, he's like fighting with it. I've seen a couple of them get hit with one of these flakes like from the back end, they take off swimming away. Like it's attacking them or something. And that might look like a lot of food because normally I would never feed this much food. But these guys will make it disappear. I promise you. It'll float down here in the bottom and they have something to eat all day long. All they do is peck at the gravel all day. But they love watching me come down the stairs in the morning when I go to work, turn on the, the light up here and they all come up here to the top and they just get all weird on me. So drop in their fish food, go to work and they're happy campers. As you can see, there's like so many that you can't see in this video. They're down here by the rocks. The bigger ones graduate to floating way up here on top because they're not they're no longer afraid. Some of the smaller ones still just hang out here at the bottom. And like the black convicts are just a few days, maybe two or three days behind these guys. But it was enough to give these uh, pink convicts a huge boost as far as getting the food first. And who's going to grow up? faster but anyways there's the 55 gallon those are the babies and i'll give you another update uh probably in the next two weeks or so show you their size before i start getting rid of all of them um if you're in the springfield area illinois let me know i'll give them to you for free all right thanks for uh tuning in make sure you subscribe to my channel and share and like with your friends and i'll see you next time